So we have done this pretty awesome backyard landscaping overhaul. Looks great back here. Um, I want to put some lighting in. So I bought two packages of these lighting kits from Lowe's. This is what it comes with. Four of these lights, two spotlights, and then a transformer um, with some wiring. So I'm planning to run the lights from the well house here because there's electricity in here. Um, so the plan is dig a trench all the way over here to this pathway and then the pathway lights up the sidewalk and then maybe the spotlights on the tree or pergola or something back here. So I got this 12 gauge wire. It's just um, thicker uh, wiring. Um, because I have such a big distance to go all the way across the yard and then we're going to go up and down the sidewalk here. Later on probably add some lights to the back. So um, this small wiring is just going to lose a lot of voltage the further it gets um, from the transformer. So I have this uh, wiring. All you do is unscrew these, strip the ends, put them under the screws one in each, and then tighten the screws down, and then the transformer's ready to go. So this is where I have the transformer mounted. I'm hoping it gets enough light um, coming in from here to, because it has a, a photo eye to detect uh, dusk and dawn when it turns on and off. So I'm hoping it gets enough light over there. It's just, that's how long the cord is. So that's as high as I could put it. Um, we'll see, I might have to move it or figure out a better place to put it if it doesn't work. Okay, so I had to <laughs> unplug it from the transformer so I could feed it underneath um, the well house here. So redid that. Now it's underneath here, coming out there. So now I just have to dig across the yard to the beginning of the sidewalk there to uh, bury the wire. here um, this honestly should not be that hard if you have like a uh, flat shovel like that you're just kind of lifting up the dirt making like a little slit and just sticking the wire down there and then stomping on it you can't really even tell this yard's a mess though I remember building this fence was one of the hardest things I ever did because had to dig every single post and there's all sorts of garbage in the yard roots everywhere so as easy as this should have been it wasn't that easy but thankfully I'm done digging now uh, when I set these lights along the sidewalk I'm just gonna bury it under the mulch so no more digging okay so I just moved this edging out of the way um, went around with the wire buried it so now I have it where, I, where it needs to be. I'm basically just going to run the wire all the way down. I'm going to go around the pergola so I don't have to go under any concrete. Um, and also we're probably going to add spotlights to the back. So the wire will already be back there. So might as well do it that way. So run it all the way around the pergola back this way. Let's go.
So I'll show you the, the best part about the, this uh, light kit is how you attach a new light to the wire. So this is attached to the light. You unscrew this bottom piece off and that you can just slide onto the wire. It'll clip on there. Hold on. See how the wire just clips in there and then this can move up and down the, the wire if needed. And then this piece has like these spikes. You screw it on here and these spikes pierce the, the coating on the wire to get power. And I'm just matching like where I put these from one side to the other. And I didn't like them like right against the sidewalk. So I have this reel and I've just kind of been using it as a template, putting it about that distance away from the sidewalk. And that way they like all match all the way, all the way down. Okay, so buried all the wire. I, um, I put some extra from the last light here around to this tree and I have it sticking out here. Um, I didn't connect this spotlight because that transformer is not big enough. So I'm gonna swap out that transformer um, in order to connect that. But for now, we're just doing the pathway lights. Okay, finished product here. Um, I did test it, all the lights turn on and the transformer is getting enough light um, in the corner of the well house there. As you can see, they're not on right now. So, see you tonight. So these lights turned out great. It really levels up the backyard. Um, like I said, I was able to use the transformer that uh, came with the kit, but I did order a larger transformer just so we can add lights to the back and stuff. So depending on, you know, your project, I would say you're probably going to need some um, bigger gauge wire and maybe a larger transformer, but otherwise this is a great kit and I highly recommend it. Thanks for checking this video out. Um, subscribe and I'll see you next time.